when is the Carabao Cup quarter-final draw, and how to watch it. The Carabao Cup is slowly but surely creeping towards its business end, with the draw for the quarter-finals now just a few days away. The fourth round has taken center stage this week, with Arsenal, Chelsea, and Sunderland sealing a spot in the last eight on Tuesday, while another five matches will be played on Wednesday evening. That includes Manchester City, who are bidding for a record-breaking fifth successive triumph in the competition, having beaten Tottenham 1-0 in April to win the trophy for a fourth season in a row. They travel to West Ham, who enter the clash full of confidence after their own 1-0 victory over the North London outfit. Tottenham will look to put the Derby defeat behind them as they travel to Burnley in what boss Nuno Espirito Santo described as a cup final, while Preston host Liverpool, Leicester welcome Brighton to the King Power Stadium and Brentford see if they can hack it on a Wednesday night in Stoke. Following the remaining fixtures comes the quarter-final draw this weekend, and Sportsmail provides all the information below. The Carabao Cup draws typically take place on a Wednesday evening, following the completion of a live broadcasted game. That won't be the case for the quarter-finals, however, with the draw scheduled for Saturday, October 30th. The draw will be broadcast live on Soccer Am, with Jimmy Ballert and Danny Mays conducting proceedings, while John Fendley hosts. No exact time has been given as of yet, but the draw will take place during the show's broadcast, which runs from 10.30 a.m. to 12 p.m. BST. Soccer Am will be broadcast live on Sky Sports Main Event and Sky Sports Premier League. The draws have been shown free of charge on Sky Sports YouTube channel thus far, which is expected to be the same once more. Three teams have already safely navigated their way into Saturday's draw, following their round of 16 victories on Tuesday evening. Arsenal continued their run of good form as they saw off the challenge of struggling Leeds to reach the last eight, while London rivals Chelsea needed penalties to overcome a stubborn Southampton. Meanwhile, Queen's Park Rangers and Sunderland shared as